On December 10th, 1993, a terrifying new world was discovered and a revolution began. Video games would never be the same. Doom was really the game that popularized the whole first-person shooter genre. It's no longer, I'm this little guy moving around on the screen. It's now you inside the world when you pull out the big guns and start going after everything. Time Magazine said Doom presented a world so powerful, compelling, and disturbing that it would change the real world around it. And now, the horror comes alive. Listen up, man. We're going in hot. If it breathes, kill it. You are, for the very first time, the first-person shooter. And what an exciting feeling that is to know that you're doing something that's never been done in film. The audience becomes me, and my POV is, is played out on the screen. The film delivers what the game delivered, which was some very raw, hard, tough, um, uncompromising scares. Should efforts of containment be endangered, eliminate with extreme prejudice. Good hunting, soldier. It's a tactical squad that's been formed, and they're called in. There's a problem on a research facility. The scientists are trying to engineer genetics, and people start getting mutated. Their orders are pretty simple, contain and calm the situation down, but it rapidly gets completely out of control, and they are put to the ultimate test. People are dropping left and right, and, you know, he's dying, he's dying, bam, me, you know, oh, I'm hitting, you know, and it's all going on when it's absolute utter chaos. It's about warfare and about being a fantasy, about surviving in situations when you shouldn't survive. There's somebody coming up behind you. What is that? we got to go now. It's so visceral, it's so real in this corridor, you know, taking down these targets, and I'm not going to lie to you, oh, I love it. You enter into this world and you're scared to death. Evacuate! Evacuate! All hell breaks loose, and it's non-stop. Sir, are you okay? <laughs>